Hey, what's going on? I'm Kevin the Tech Ninja, and I'm here to show you an incredible product that is enabled by ARM technology. This is the Sunflower Labs Beehive One system. It is the world's first fully autonomous security drone. This drone will launch into the air automatically if it detects a person on your property. Now in person, it's really amazing to see. With ARM partners shipping more than 180 billion chips based on ARM processors into a vast range of applications, it is no surprise that the Sunflower Beehive system is powered by Cortex-M and A processors. Look, in fact, it's not just one, but there are four processors in the system. The Cortex-M4, Cortex-M0, Cortex-M33, and a Cortex-A57 all of which enables the drone, the base station, and the sensors. Here is how it works. There are three main components. The sunflowers, which looks like garden lights, but they're actually very sophisticated activity sensors. They use infrared motion sensors combined with a vibration sensor, and they can determine if there are people, animals, or cars on your property. They also have powerful lights that will illuminate your property, and you can even change the colors to set the mood. The B, which is the fully autonomous drone equipped with an HD camera with night vision and obstacle avoidance sensors. The propellers also have guards on them to protect the blades. Has around 15 minutes of flight, however, each flight should only last a few minutes and this drone is also water resistant. The obstacle avoidance helps it from hitting buildings and trees and other objects. And also, it maps your house so each flight the drone gets more and more confident. So for example, if there's like a ladder or something else in the way, the drone will see it and then it stops and goes over it using its sensors. And then the next time it flies, it'll be looking out for that same object. And then the hive, the hive is the base station. It opens up and the drone flies out. And then when it's time to land, the drone comes back, it drops in and then the base station closes. This is the brains of the operation. It's using AI data processing to determine the best route and figure out what exactly the sensors are seeing. The Hive also charges the drone when it's docked. It's around the same size as a DJI Phantom and it looks really good in flight. The app gives you a layout of your house and all the points of interest. You map it out within the app and you give them names. So for example, you have pool and garage. When the object walks into the area, the sensors will tell you what it sees and where it sees it at. From there, you can press inspect on the app and it launches to the last known location. And when it does that, you can watch it live within the app and in the app you have additional controls. You can swipe left or right to spin the drone or pinch for the drone to move closer. You can also tap other locations and the drone will continue to fly to those locations and you can snap a photo too. When the flight is done, you'll get a report laid out and this report will give you information about the flight, like duration and what it saw. And you can also look at the report in real time as it's generating, which is really cool to see. Then you can download the video, share it with the police or put it anywhere that accepts videos. So I tried this out in a residential location and the system is great for people who have large properties, but I also think there is a commercial usage too, like industry, agricultural, storage facilities, and car dealerships. You know, basically any large space would benefit from a security system like this. As a person that reviews tech, there's very little that gets me so excited like this did, but this was really amazing to see how it worked. Now, this is one of many AI products that's powered by ARM, and this is only the first version of the product. I can't wait to see where it goes from here. My name is Kevin the Tech Ninja, and this has been powered by ARM AI. Thank you for watching.